are back at the American Airlines Center Friday night after a week-long road trip, squaring off against the Brooklyn Nets, which has seven games to go into the NBA All-Star break. Hey everyone, I'm Tamara Jolie. This is D210 TV right here on Time Warner Sports Channel. Well, as head coach Rick Carlisle said, the Mavs grinded into the end, took care of business. Chandler Parsons had his first double-double of the season, finishing with a team-high 19 points, 12 rebounds, and a lot of people say, hey, is Parsons on a hot stretch right now? He says he doesn't think so. He's actually just playing with a lot of confidence. I hope to continue to do it consistently. Um, you know, that's the plan, but uh, you know, this whole process has been one day at a time for me. And good games, bad games, you know, hot streak, playing horrible. Uh, I just take it day by day and try not to look ahead and try not to force anything or put any more expectations to play basketball, have all the time to Zaza Petulia added great production for the Mavericks, who is back in the lineup tonight, logging his 21st double-double of the season. That ties his career high. He had 16 points, 12 rebounds, but he says, hey, I'm most proud of the Mavs' defensive effort tonight. Defense was the key tonight. We played really good defense, defended the three-point line pretty well, and uh, they shot on the 40%, and uh, you know, defense helped us win the game. The Mavericks on offense really had an overall great team performance. Several players finishing in double figures. Take a look at Dirk's performance though tonight. 12 points, 8 rebounds, and a season high 4 blocks. He says for the Mavericks though, taking care of business at home is key. That was a good win for us against, uh, you know, uh, it's a tough team. You know, they just beat uh, OKC at home a couple nights ago and we watched that game. And we had to be ready, so it was a good start. A tough back-to-back -back coming up, but you know, obviously Phoenix and then going to Atlanta. Um, Atlanta beat us here early in the year. Phoenix is young and athletic, so got our hands full, but this is definitely a, a good way to start. The Mavericks improved to 27-22 and 22 on the season. They'll be back on Sunday to face Tyson Chandler and the Phoenix Suns. That's it for us. This is the D210 TV Mavs post-game locker report right here on Time Warner Sports Channel. I'm Tamara Jolie, and you've just been credentialed.